everybody. So today we're going to show you how to use the Sino Kit with an IO. Um, as you probably know, Sino Kit is in a glass bottle. You can't squeeze it, so pushing it through an IO is rather difficult. So Lieutenant Presball here has come up with a way to do a push-pull method using this valve. So what we have here is a three-way stopcock. Uh, you'll start your IO either uh, in tibia or the the humerus, you'll apply your stopcock directly to that, and then you can hook your Sino kit up on this end. All right, so we're gonna give you an up close view of how this is assembled. So this is your stopcock. Of course, this will be hooked up to your IO. It's just not right now. Um, make it look real, we'll hook it up. All right, so take your stopcock, hook it in right there, being as sterile as you can, and then you're gonna hook your IO uh, line on this end. On the other end, you're gonna take your 60cc syringe. Also be sure and flush that with saline. I just don't have it flushed right now. So wherever it says off, that is the line it's, it's, it's obstructing. So you can actually turn this and obstruct this and have it flowing through this, but obviously it's not gonna do that on an IO. So for the first part, you're gonna have this line to the IO off and your line to your Sino kit open. And this is where we're gonna start to draw up 60 cc. Like I said, it takes a little time because it's kind of thick. You got to get air in there. And remember, you want to give this over 15 minutes. So for an adult, we're giving five grams, which is going to be everything you have. It's going to take you about three times of pushing and pulling to get the proper amount, approximately. So once you get it hooked into that, you're going to turn this valve to where now your line is off and it's on to the I.O., and from there, you're gonna push. Just do a slow push. Being an IO, it's gonna take a little time anyways, but try to take your time so you can let this take approximately 15 minutes for your first dose of Sino Kit. And another thing is, if you can't get it to come into the syringe from the bag, make sure your little vent valve is open on your... Yeah, this is one thing that your a lot IV. of people forget about because we're not used to it with normal IVs. So once that's complete, cycle back, turn it off towards the patient, draw it up, and then push it again. That's if it. If any of you have seen the Sino kit done on an IO before, well, we haven't used this, this valve yet, but it just takes time to pulling and pushing. It's the, the liquid's a little bit thicker, plus it takes a little while to, for the air to equalize. So just Take your time with it and eventually you'll get every, all the, the dose that you need.